what up this your boy boss and welcome back to the channel as always i appreciate y'all coming through and checking out the videos but today we ain't got much going on in the fish room all the tanks are doing very well everything is striving we got some more breeding going on we got new babies things like that is always changing down here in the fish room and i will give you guys an update on that in a future video but yesterday i had went to one of my local pet stores that i haven't been to in a while and they got tons of saltwater fish freshwater fish reptiles and tons of different things so i went to the store and you guys know i can't go without recording so i'm gonna send you you guys to that footage and i hope you enjoy but yeah we're finna walk up into this store and see what they got going on man aquatic environments in davenport isle i ain't been over here in a while i want to see what they got going on Ooh, what's going on how y'all doing what's going on what's going on come to check out some of y'all fish see what's going on what's going on chris chilling chilling my salt water tank then crashed on me Tracy ain't no help. But yeah, they got a, um, a bunch of different stuff in here. They got salt water in here. You can see they got tons of different salt water tanks and things like that. But I want to come look at the fresh water because you guys know I'm a fresh water guy. So let's come see what they got going on in here today. They like got some people in here buying stuff. Excuse me. Ooh. So we got a couple of these tanks. Well, they got some rams, some guppies up in here. Got some nice little gouramis. Like right that's a uh, electric blue Jack Dempsey. I haven't seen one of those in a while. up here sore tails little mollies that's a fat tetra right there look how fat that tetra is like it's little belly finna blow up and what we got down here silver dollars and some nice sized tiger bars in there and it's a nice that's a nice pleco. I don't know what type of pleco those are. Let me see. Yeah, you don't have a list of. Oh, maybe it's the marble cell fin pleco. They're pretty awesome. They even got some. Look at the little dwarf frogs in there, too. It's pretty awesome. Look at all this hardscape down here. I need to buy some more hardscape for my tanks. Oh, look, we got some African. What is this right here? Never seen that little fish before. That's crazy. African is beautiful. Nothing up in there. Oh, we got some monsters. That's like a needle nose gar. A knife fish is that a black African knife? Another one right there. Look at that guard, though. Huh? It's pretty cool. Look at these fat. What kind of fish is that? Look like you made a whole little cave back there. Look like some type of South or Central American. Well, you guys can let me know in the comment section. What kind of fish this is? I look like that's a convict right there. That's some blood parrots. But what kind of fish is this? I'm not 100% sure. Here we got some assorted Africans, some OBs, things of that nature. Look real nice. We got all our brackish fish over here we're not all brackets but some of these are brackets you got the scats i mean not the scats what are those yeah silver scats and then you got the green scats Looks like you got some jewels in there i mean i guess pretty much most of these fish are brackish or could be acclimated to salt most of all these fishes come from like the streams and stuff down in florida especially like these jewels you can find these jewels down up in the lakes, I mean not the lakes, but like the streams and stuff, the little canals. 
bunch of Africans up there. I got plenty of these at home. Zebra oblique ones. They got a little bit of copyright, so I need to kind of move out that spot because that copyright is loud. Uh, here we got some Tiger Oscars. That's a nice black one right there. It looks really healthy. Some nice little cats. They got these big old fish in this little tank. That's a huge tentacle bar. That thing, somebody must have brought that in. It's huge. We got some more Africans up here. And some nice peacocks. Look like they could be potentially get some nice color on them. Got a nice little, another tank of some Africans, like some eye biters in here. Bunch of different stuff. Look at all that driftwood up there though. It's crazy. Ooh, they got shrimp in here now. Cherry shrimp, nice little cherries. Tons of different type of plants. Italia, Red Luigia, Myro. This looks really nice. Yeah, it looks, it looks so so. It looks pretty healthy though. Got plenty of duckweed. I got more of this at home than I could ever want. They selling the duckweed for eight dollars a little pot. I need to start selling duckweed. Got plenty of that. A little axolotl. Little baby axolotl. I still want to get one of those for the fish room. Just, you got to have like a chiller and stuff. There's another one up in here. There's a terrible glare on that. They got a decent amount of selection and stuff going on here today. Let's see what's over here. I like some Tetras, some Angels. Some rainbows over here. Oh, look at this. Look at these big old conjo tetras. That's a nice conjo tetra, man. Even a, uh, a nice Geo Vegas right here as well. And those Rolls Royce sharks. Oh, nice, nice, nice. They even got some blue diamonds like I got. I'm gonna pay charges for those. Blue diamonds are 70 a piece. The other ones are like 89. Wow. Some beautiful distance though. I like these uh these ones right here. They got like that bright orange with the white face. They're super decent. And we got some more Congo Tetris down here. Look at all these. That's cool. That's a little powder blue. Baramis up here. And there's some nice little small angels right there. They decent. Little hatch. I forget what they call it, like hatch fish. So yeah, silver hatchets, silver hatchets. They're decent too. This over here is bettas. Plenty of bettas. The light gives the tanks a nice flicker, so you guys don't want to see that. Ooh, look at these guys over here. Huge little turtles. That's a nice turtle. You got more in here, too. Crazy. Oh, my God. Look at that, yo. A milk snake? That's crazy. Yeah, let me keep looking around. I'll show you guys some of this saltwater fish too as well. I know some of you guys not really into salt, but they still got some amazing saltwater fish, so These guys over here. Ooh, nice big old clown. Saltwater fish do be 
dope though. I ain't gonna cap. They be super nice. As you guys see, man, they got so much stuff up in here. They even sell tanks and stuff too. They got tanks up in here. All type of stuff. Look at this big old tank over here. This might be my thumbnail. <laughs> so, but uh, yeah, it's dope. Use a hundred gallon tank, six hundred. This thing huge. Step back so y'all can see how big that tank is. The tank is huge. Thing about me is I can't have big tanks in my basement because my ceiling too short and I can't get things down my stairs so I can't even have those type of big tanks in my house otherwise I would have monster tanks y'all trust me I would have monster tanks I just can't get them downstairs you know what I'm saying it just don't work well yeah, let me go ahead and get out of here I'm sorry it's hard to record in that store because they got a lot of music playing a lot of copyright and stuff like that um so still decent I'm going to be out here probably like next week and I'm going to have you help me get all the products and stuff I need to get yeah, my yeah. tank right. Take some pictures and shit. Okay. All right. Thank you, bro. Yeah, I need to get my salt water together, man, because my salt water has the bucket. I can't say the word, but it has just right now because so many fresh water tanks that I got. I can't keep up with the salt water, so I didn't went this on me. So my man's Chris out here at Aquatic Environment is going to come through and get me right help me get all the products i need to get my stuff right so if you guys ever need live in my area you need salt water help or anything like that make sure you guys come out here to the aquatic environment because they always showing love to your boy and uh you know willing to help out people they just really down to earth people man well i hope you guys enjoyed that little store footage it's always nice going to aquatic environments and checking out the store and seeing what they got going on over there as you see they got tons of salt water uh tons of fresh water even got the reptile like them snakes and them turtles i mean i'm a turtle guy but the snakes i can't mess with all those snakes i like lizards they cool but the snakes i'm cool on snakes like that especially like them poisonous ones i like pythons because they kind of peaceful but they still can get you though but them poisonous snakes i'm cool on all that stuff but hope you guys enjoyed that little footage man that's pretty much gonna be it for today's video man make sure you guys stay tapped in with the channel we got a lot more coming um, the next few videos will be adding the rest of these aquariums down here, getting all those set up and looking good. I'm going to be moving the fish out the pond into this new aquarium. Give you guys an update on the pond, the turtle pond, the monster tank. We still got a lot of stuff going on. I got a, I just got a new monster fish that I haven't even showed you guys yet, and it's beautiful. So uh, just stay tapped in because we got a lot more coming. I just got a space of content out so it don't get so redundant, you know what I'm saying? So stay tapped in, and I will catch you guys in my next video. I'm out of here. Thank you.